Hey everybody, it's August 5th, so this is going to be 11 weeks that I've been growing hydroponic veggies in my greenhouse. It's going uh, pretty dang good. Nice cucumber way up here. That's uh, higher than I can reach. It's funny, more of the last year, all the lots of flowers coming up top. The tomatoes are starting to come in and change color now. The cucumbers, cucumber here. Kind of size. This guy's funny. A little J cucumber. I don't know, buddy. Uh, peppers are coming up pretty good. This is just in a cracky bucket, which doesn't have electronics. All these Dutch buckets are. Oh, these cucumbers here. These are delicious. I've been eating one a day off these guys. And uh, as I said last week, or last video, I put them with uh, sesame oil, uh, vinegar, and soy sauce. Kind of flatten them out a little bit, cut them into small chunks, put it in the fridge for a couple hours, and it's a great little salad. Lots of tomatoes here on these four plants. Finally getting some peppers in, which is awesome to see, finally. And these guys are really taking off. There's, I don't know, like 10 on here. And I'll go around the other side. There's more here. There's some sort of super hots. That's good. There's some tomatoes down there. Tomatoes there. Some collard greens in here. So other assorted peppers, the basil coming up. This is just a cutting off one I bought. So all the roots coming up. Some celery here that is also just cut off from a store bought one. Pretty cool roots. Just twist it back in. Let's see the roots of these guys. Compared to uh, yeah, these guys are still a little, but they're starting to perk up. These guys. This is a cucumber plant here. Look at those roots. It's crazy. And the tomato. Can I hardly open it? So I clean off uh, the inside there at the bottom, off this tube going in, just so it doesn't get stuck. And it just goes back down to the little tank. It's got the pump. Got a bunch of beans here as well. I, some of them are drying out. I gotta eat these quick. So I'll go on the Blackstone grill. And lots more flowers too for the peppers. So hopefully these peppers take off because I gotta make a bunch of hot sauce for our Monday night football team. And look at the little squiggly lines here. The cucumber here from the plant that comes from oh it's just this guy. But this these guys up there. <coughs> this one here coming down. Through here, another guy. <coughs> yeah. So this bucket at the end, that cucumber over there, just from him. Wow. Well, that baby doesn't sound happy. But, well, maybe they'll get a greenhouse and be happier. This is also a cracky bucket tomatoes so it had a, an issue the water emptied out on this but the new roots are, are growing up good and someone did ask last time I do use the general hydroponics flora series it's about $60 Canadian for these three and I just put a, a shot glass of each one in, in the tank once a week that's the Wednesday job So yeah, it's been a good week.
been seeing lots of bears lately too on my bike rides to work so there's some videos of that and there's some on my facebook too if you really need to see me chasing bears and also a clip of uh, our friends in bcdc that we saw a couple times this week great acdc cover band the size of that it's crazy all right so that's it it's looks like it's salad time and once all these tomatoes ripen up it's gonna be tomatoes for every meal all right so that's uh the seven or uh 11 weeks it's all over the floor this pepper is starting to come up that's cool tomatoes all over here they're starting to go outside it's crazy all right thanks for watching i'll see you in about a week because uh yeah it'll start taking off here i'll have uh fill up this whole ceiling probably It's touching the ceiling. Good stuff. Okay, bye.